Hello, my name is Cesar Miranda, very proud principal of Choya High School. Welcome and go Chargers! So hi, my name is Laisha Valdez, and this year I'm a senior at Choya High School. This year I've been taking AVID, and it is a class that helps you a lot with organization, collaboration, um, reading and writing skills. Hi, my name is Jesus Romero. I come to Choya High Magnet School. Uh, I really like this school because, well, there's a lot of friendly people. That might just because might be because I'm Mexican, and there's a lot of Mexican students around, but. Not just everybody's really friendly. We have a great automotive class. We have construction. Uh, and then we have Mexican-American culture classes. Hi, my name is Mark Perez. I am a senior here at Choi High School. One of my favorite classes that I am taking is African-American English. One thing that I like about it so much is how much that we learn about other cultures. Being Hispanic, learning about black culture has taught me a lot of things, not only about the history, but what is going on currently in the U.S. And one thing that we do learn about is how to think with our subconscious mind, which is really important because it really changes how we think about things and how we can view other people's opinions and viewpoints. My name is Madison Livingood, and I'm a senior at Troy High School. And one of the 21st century programs that I really enjoy is Garden Club. Um, Garden Club, we just, we grow plants, we clean the pond in the commons, and we feed all the fish in Miss Hetchell's room. And all the plants we grow from the garden, we sell for fundraisers. And we're working on getting chicken. And whatever the chickens lay, we're gonna also use for fundraising. My name is Joanne Lariega, and I'm the AVID coordinator at Choya High School. AVID stands for Advancement via Individual Determination. And our goal and mission is to close the opportunity gap for students and help them get success in our increasingly global society. We have the AVID elective, which helps students focus on study skills within their school and discover colleges, majors, careers that they might be interested in. Hi, my name is Dr. Green and I am the IBE coordinator here at Choya High School. One of the things I love the most about the IB program, other than just the great opportunities it provides for the students, are the students. The students are the ones that make this program absolutely amazing, and I love working with them. Hello, I'm Julian Quijal Mutiel. I'm a senior at Choya. What I've appreciated about the IB program here is how it puts me in a room with like-minded classmates and allows me to further explore subjects that impact me directly and impact the world I live in while also allowing me the chance to expand in resources and learn how to better cite and find information that I may need in the future and how to interpret that to discuss it with my peers. What makes Troy a really great school are two things. One is our students and our families. They're wonderful, they're hardworking, they bring so many rich, different perspectives and diversity to Troya that every student and every person is contributing in some small way here. And the second part of that equation is our staff. We're great at developing strong rapport and relationships with our students. Hi, my name is Steve Spies. I'm the senior Army instructor for the Choya program. My assistant instructor is Hector Simon. We both had a 20 year career in the United States Army active duty. And I wanna be upfront with you first is that we're not recruiters, we're educators. And with that said, I'd like to take an opportunity to enlighten you on your decision to enroll in the Choya ROTC program. You have indeed chosen to learn and live to a higher standard of excellence when you become a Army Junior ROTC cadet. You have decided to be different, to challenge yourself, and to be the very best that you can be. Choya Junior ROTC is a gold star unit, an outstanding program that helps you train be a better citizen and a leader in tomorrow's challenges. 